Hello everyone, today I'll be showing how to make your Minecraft look more classic. So first of all, you're gonna have to go to this website, which I'm gonna put the link in the description. You're gonna have to download this texture pack I made. In the description you can see everything I changed. Anyways, you can download the texture pack using the download button which will take you to the Medifier website. You can download the texture pack, but make sure to not click on the advertisements. Now, you open the search tab and type percentage of pp data percentage. Open it in open.minecraft folder. Now find the folder called resource packs and then you open your download folder. Drop the texture pack inside the resource packs folder in .minecraft. However, I already have it installed because I made it, so I'm just gonna uninstall the texture pack. But you won't do that, you'll simply drop the texture pack inside the resource packs folder. So now, you're gonna launch Minecraft 1.17.1 or you're gonna launch Minecraft 1.17, it doesn't matter. After 3500 years, my Minecraft has finally launched. So anyways, you're gonna join any world you want. You can also create a world, but it doesn't matter. So once you're here, you can see how boring the world looks. Now, you're gonna press S, then you're gonna go to resource packs and then you'll select the classic art. You can see, it already looks incredible, just like the actual alpha Minecraft. It even has the old sounds, such as door and hurt sound. The crafting table is called workbench, the chest is not so 3D anymore and the furnace has no top texture. So now you're gonna go to settings. Then you're gonna disable smooth lighting. You'll change render distance to somewhere between 2 and 8. Then you're gonna change clouds to fast, so it turns 2D. And you're gonna set a FPS cap. And boom, you've got yourself a beautiful alpha Minecraft in 1.17. So now, to make your experience even better, you're gonna install this mod called Beta Days. You're gonna need to go to this website. I'm gonna put the link in the description. This mod currently is on 1.16.5, but that's okay. My texture pack will still work on the version, even though it is made for the 1.17 version. So you're gonna download the 1.16.5 version. Now you wait 5 seconds and you're gonna start downloading the beta days mod. Now you open the .minecraft folder and the download folder. Then you drop the beta days mod inside the mods folder. If your .minecraft folder doesn't have a mods folder, it is okay, just create one. So now, you gotta launch Minecraft Forge 1.16.5. I expect you to have Forge as it is the most used Minecraft mod of all time, but if you don't, I suggest you search online. So once you're done loading, your Minecraft won't look like mine. It will look like normal Minecraft. I only told you to launch Minecraft so the mod could install some files that you'll need to edit. Go back to .minecraft and find a folder called config. Open that folder and edit these two files. You can either edit them with the notepad, which is in everyone's computer or you can edit it with a notepad++, which I think is better, so I'll use it. Now everything is customizable. You can change the menu to become the alpha menu. You can remove the 1.9 combat update. You can remove the hunger bar. You can remove running etc. 
I'm gonna remove all of them so it becomes as close as possible to the actual alpha Minecraft. Once you're done, you can close everything and open Minecraft. As you can see, Minecraft now looks just like the alpha version, but don't forget to enable my texture pack. After that, you can join a world. As you can see, the only thing that changed was the version of the game up there, but fear not, citizen, if you change the survival, everything will change. In the meanwhile, look at the resource pack, it looks amazing. Boom there we go, looks just like Alpha Minecraft. Anyways. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed watching this video, if something didn't work while doing this comma please let me know so I can help you, subscribe and turn on the bell if you want to watch more videos like this, like if you liked, dislike if you disliked, adios amigos.